Paul was a true leader of the Warriors, both on and off the field, from his first day arriving on campus all the way from Sault Ste. Marie. A five-year starter at center, his aggressiveness, athletic ability, grit, and pure strength made him an absolute beast to play against in the Warriors' vaunted rushing attack. His football IQ made him a natural to call out defensive fronts and blocking assignments. A multi-year team captain, Sklenia was a big part of the Warriors' success, winning the Ace Cups in both 1997 as well as in 1999. Individually, in 1998 as well as in 2000, Paul was not only an OUA All-Star, but also a first-team All-Canadian. In 2000, Paul was honored as the Waterloo Male Athlete of the Year and is also a member of the Waterloo Athletics Hall of Fame. I met Paul 20 years ago. He sat in this locker. Um, he was, uh, you know, had squirrely hair and he wore these white ponies and he had wool socks and his feet stunk. And, um, but he's pretty damn good as a freshman. Uh, he was a, a great leader. Um, leader of our Warrior football program. Uh, a true catalyst in our success in, in winning some Yates Cups. And uh, I really uh, believe, uh, you know, you were a, a tough son of a bitch. No, 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 sorry, Marie. Um, but uh, you really were the toughest guy. You're the toughest guy I know, and and uh, you, you were also athletic and agile, and, and snapped the ball, and, and pulled out, and, and uh, unloaded on people out in space, and, and um, you know there was a lot of special attributes for, for what you did on the football field because you're not obviously the biggest guy in stature, and, and so you made up for it with your grit and your toughness and your athleticism and, and your leadership most importantly. First and foremost, Wig, sorry I couldn't be there tonight. Uh, it's amazing who they're letting into this ring of honor now, so um, congratulations. Um, you know, I look back on it, there's, uh, there's a tremendous uh, relationship between the center and quarterback, and the, probably the best story I could think of is uh, we were in the middle of a game, and I think I got hit, which uh, Probably wasn't one of my favorite things to happen during the game, but uh, I had turned around and screamed at all the offensive linemen, and uh, he had grabbed me by the scruff of my neck and said, that's my own line, don't talk to my own line again. And uh, I think from that day forward, we went forward with the same type of mutual respect that you take care of the old line, and uh, essentially looked, it was like having two quarterbacks out in the field. Great friend, uh, great center, uh, great protector. Uh, probably could have done without the uh, uh, Friday night practices without any underwear, but uh, besides that, uh, congratulations, Swig. Couldn't happen to a better person, and once again, sorry I couldn't be there. Have a great night, guys. Thank you for your friendship, and uh, the biggest thing that I know uh, for the last 20 years is that you're a, a good man, a good husband, a good father, and a great friend, and a great supporter of Warrior Football. So congratulations, Squiggy. Uh, it's a good thing I'm the head coach. Uh, Congratulations on your induction into the Waterloo Warriors Ring of Honor.